Returning back to our farm and ranch news, a government shutdown is possible this fall. That's the prediction from some GOP House Agriculture Committee members. The House's failure to pass the Agriculture Appropriations Funding Bill before the August recess could not only cause a shutdown, but hold up passing a new farm bill this year, which is a concern to groups like the National Potato Council. The hang-up lane is that you know, we're not in an election year. We have a number of folks who just got to Congress from the last election, and I think they really want to kind of capitalize on some of their campaign pledges and roll back spending in certain areas. One holdup is USDA's spending on nutrition programs. Some folks want to roll back that spending, and so they've attached a number of amendments that are fairly controversial to that House Ag Approps bill. It's kind of tearing at the traditional bipartisanship of that bill, where it normally would have long been passed by now that we get to the August recess. It failed last week. Uh, they were not able to, um, to pass it across the House floor. They're going to need to come back in September. It's possible that we could have a shutdown this year. Ultimately, I don't think that's sustainable. It probably will end up in, in a continuing resolution, which just keeps spending flatline for a period of time. The funding debate puts in doubt if a farm bill can be passed this year, but agriculture groups are confident lawmakers can come together and resolve their differences. That's today's Farm and Ranch News. The preceding news segment was produced for MTN by the Western Ag Network.